We left for the reason that I got my phone stolen. Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video it's a video i almost was about to say welcome to another vlog because that's my usual intro intro oh my god what is happening um <laughs> y'all i forgot to do sit down video today as you can tell from the title i'm gonna be doing a little bag haul but it's not really little because this is a lot of bags like let me tell you okay side rant side rants okay i've never realized how much how much how many bags i had until I put them all together like they were on the um, dinner table and I was looking at them I'm like what in the world how did they get this how did they get to this amount but anyway and I still want more some people have shoe obsession I think I have a bag obsession okay so right now I'm gonna show you guys my bizarre bag collection because it was supposed to be a business um initially when i was buying them i was like i'm gonna start selling this weird bizarre bags and stuff with a weird you know collection and when it got here i looked at it and i started by the way i launched it created a youtube not youtube but i created a an instagram account and then i launched it on my other deleted channel and after a week i was like i can't do this because i am trying to grow my personal brand okay ekranamu as a brand so i decided in my head in the middle of the night that it was way much easier for me to start as me as in first i start growing me as a brand like you know how you can hear kim kardashian you know exactly who she is so if she sells kim's clothes fragrance it's easier to brand it it's easier to promote it to market it because the brand kim kardashian has already been formed so i was like i'm gonna grow my ekranamu brand first before i grow or that i generate the ekranamu closet so let's get into the video so the first work i'm gonna show you guys is you know let me just zoom you guys out i think that's better so we're gonna start with this snake print um bag First of all, I have memories with this bag, y'all, because let me show you the strap. The strap is broken, okay? And I'm gonna tell you exactly why it broke, where it broke, and what happened for it to break because, girl, I got all that locked up in here. So, uh, it was 2019, 2018. I'm not sure. But it was Oktoberfest, the one that happens in October, and it was in, um, it was hosted, what was it, um, Gong Rescos, I think, yeah, and was it Oktoberfest or Taskafest? Something about Tasca and October, I don't remember y'all, clearly what the event was, but I remember it was my first ever event-ish thingy, because I don't like going to crowded places, so, okay, I being me, me being myself, this is the bag I went to for an event. That's when I realized I am stupid because this in an event where people get stolen for stuff, this is the bag I'm, co I'm what I'm going with. So I was, you know, having fun with my friends. Um, you know, the, the event used to go out all up until the morning, but I think we left there like at midnight or something. So. We left for the reason that I got my phone stolen. Like, I, this is the bag I was wearing, and then we, uh, I don't know who was performing or what was happening on a stage, but we went to a place where there was, there was a stage, and there was someone on the stage, I can't freaking remember because, y'all, <laughs> I can't freaking remember. So, because I was so distracted. So, I just had my bag snap. <laughs> and when I looked inside, there were three phones. There was my phone, my friend's phone, and another friend's phone. But they took mine. And, uh, maybe because it was huge. It was, um, what was it? It was the iPhone 8 Plus, I guess. And it wasn't a huge cover. Y'all know I got the weird, um, 
pointy squared covers so it was big so when he like put his hands in that's the first thing i think he caught because the other phones were shorter because they didn't have a mega phone case but anyway <laughs> i will always remember this bag because that's when i got my phone stolen and then that's when i got this um iphone xr that i've been using for i think for a while i think since that time it was either 2018 no it's not even about either i think it was 2018 or 2019 no it was 2019 i'm gonna go with 2019 anyway the next bag i'm gonna show you it doesn't have a story to it but this is a jungle what is this is it like jungle green or something um it's very long it has a really long strap and this bag belonged to my mom i guess and i took it and never returned it i think it was hers uh what is oh my god i have a pin inside here um where can i like find money or something anyway so i think this bag belonged to my mom i'm assuming and then there was a time she was dip disposing bags and i was i thought this was kind of cute because i like tiny cute bags so i was like maybe this is i can take it or something i think that's what was happening so yeah i got this cute jungle green bag i like using it a lot because i can easily match it and it's big enough to fit i just need something that fits my phone my wallet and my keys my car keys because my home keys i leave them in my car when i'm going somewhere i don't know why but i leave it in the car next i'm gonna go uh -uh, I laugh. anyway guys so the next bag i'm gonna show you guys is this one ella please it's this one um uh, i got this online i bought it from aliexpress and out of the bag that i got from aliexpress i think this was the most disappointing one because it didn't look exactly like like the material of this was not what I expected but if I dress it cutely with a cute little dress it looks amazing so I really can't throw it away but it was it was cheap I think I got this for like I think 3k or something or 2500 from Aliexpress so yeah um the next bag I'm gonna show you guys is this black one um of course it's black um this bag i had overused it <laughs> like if you've ever of oh my god it's just full of gum anyway if you've ever used a bag to the point that you feel like it's complaining it's this bag everywhere i went it's full of foam anyway anywhere i went i used to use it because it was quite easy to like walk around with it and the moment you you lock it like this it looks like a bucket bag so it's very cute and very classy and when i have it locked up like this it's not gonna be that easy to like pickpocket me because you have to try and open it so when i lock it like that it looks like a basket not a basket but the bucket bag so yeah this was this is one of that is so pretty i haven't used it in a while because i gave it a break plus i bought a bunch of tote bags so they kind of gave it a rest because now i use my tote bag everywhere i go and then the next bag i'm gonna show you guys is this one uh this is well it has like a little bit on print um it comes with this little bag inside my mom got this for us um she got this for me from i don't know where but oh my god i have brand new lip balm in this maybe i should start checking my bags often and also have a full unopened pack of gum anyway so she got this from an online store i'm not really sure what the online store was but it comes with a matching pair of shoes it looks exactly like this one it's pink and then it has it has this Louis Vuitton print and then it has this fluffiness on top now I, I have never used this bag I have never used this bag and I've never worn the shoes so I need to find like a scenario or I need to find an outfit where I'm gonna match it with this bag and the matching shoes uh, so next I'm gonna show you guys is this basketball bag 
Um, this bag I got from a friend when I was internshiping. When I was doing my internship, and um, it has nothing inside. At a media house, so I had a friend there who was selling bags. So I got this for I think two thousand or something. So I got this bag. It's very cute and very unique. When I'm going somewhere, it can fit my stuff, but not really. Not all of them, but I kind of try and squeeze them inside. So yeah, okay. I have used this once or twice or something. So it's not like I've never used it before. Next, you guys, we are going to be looking at my backpacks now, okay? So this is a Love Heart backpack that I I have stayed a while without using this bag. Like I haven't used this bag in a really really long time um i don't know but this is just a cute little love hug um backpack that i can use to go to school with or to a an afternoon activity you know maybe i'm going to the park or somewhere where i don't need to look too fancy and i need to carry extra stuff so this is a cute one this is my mom got for me i don't know from where I'm not sure but you know some of these things I really don't know where they come from I'm, I'm just given them I, like, my mom just gives them to me so yeah this one and then the next bag we're gonna look at is this cutie pie it's a what is it called sequin um it has this sequin material and the ears and I have never used this bag or maybe I used okay, I think I used it. My mom got this for me on our trip to Dubai uh, for 2020 New Year before Corona started. So I think I was using it around Dubai when we were walking around. <laughs> Even this bag, I was using it around Dubai. So anyway, so I think I've used this before. So I can't say I haven't used it because I used it around that time. Yeah, I used it. So there's this one. And then the next one I have this, I don't know how this bag is called, but it's the bag that you wear around here. It's not really a backpack, but I don't know what they're called. I'm gonna ruin, I'm gonna mess the hair that I just ended. Anyway, so it's a cute little pink one. I have used this so much. It's so comfy if I'm going, I can't say hiking, I don't really hike. But if I'm going somewhere that doesn't need, doesn't require me to look very, very fancy or classy. And I need to store a lot of stuff. It has so many compartments. It has the big compartment. Is there anything inside? I don't want to know what this is. Uh, and then it has the tiny ones where I can hide my phone and my wallet. And then it has this other one over here. And also, it's so easy, like you can carry a skinny bottle of water, you can put it over here or inside. So I have used this a couple of times. And then the next bag I'm gonna show you guys is my violin bag, y'all. Oh my God, I am obsessed with this bag because I have used it a couple of times to go to school mostly because to go to school or to go somewhere you know anywhere because it is so so comfy and so cute like look at that y'all look at this it is so cute um i got this from aliexpress as well and i think i got this for five thousand four four to five thousand minus shipping plus shipping I don't know, but I remember paying around almost 5000 for this one, and that included shipping. So let's just say it's between 4000 and 5000 that's what I spent for this violin bag that I have used multiple, multiple, multiple times. So guys, that is all I had for you in this part one of this video. Stay tuned for part two that I'm going to upload, I think, next week, one of the days. So stay tuned for that. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please do give me a thumbs up. Comment down below what you want to see on my channel. And if you've gotten to the end of this, you can as well subscribe to my channel. Turn on that notification bell so you can never ever miss on any of my new amazing videos. And then guys, I'm going to see you in my next video. Goodbye. Love you all. Mm -hmm. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her.
She's a Mona Lisa Everyone's planning